we are starting out this video on actually Tuesday and this is gonna be a little Halloween vlog I'm kind of putting together my own costume I ordered some things online for it and I have to glue some stuff onto it because we're gonna be like a mermaid slash siren he's gonna be like a pirate so I'll show you the process of me doing that and making my costume a little later but today we're going to pick up his costume because we're gonna try to just find one like at Party City or something so go see if we can find one because I didn't want to wait too long it's October 24th today and I feel like the longer you wait more sold out they are of costumes because I'm being a mermaid I wanted my nails to look kind of like fish scales so I decided to do one coat of this iridescent purple nail polish as the first coat and then I did one coat of whitish iridescent polish on top with this pearl looking nail polish on top of that and I also decided to add on little half pearls and rhinestones so that they were kind of sparkly and honestly they turned out so pretty and I really loved the way that they looked to go carve pumpkin which i'm so excited about because carving pumpkins is so much fun even though i always struggle with what to carve on them but i'm gonna try to figure it out on the way over <laughs> this weekend is basically when all of the halloween festivities are going down because halloween is on a tuesday this year so let's go carve some pumpkins the fit of the day this little dragon shirt is from brandy melville and i kind of forgot i had it it just found it in my dresser and i was like why not cargo pants from brandy melville as well Today is Friday, it's the next day, and I am going to start assembling my costume today. Honestly, I feel like I have a lot to do <laughs> for the costume, but it's gonna be okay. I'm going to like bead this top with shells and pearls and put pearls down it. It looks kind of big though, it just came in the mail and I've tried it on and it's a little bit big. I honestly might not even wear the straps if it will stay up. I didn't really like the straps, I just, I liked the shape of the top and stuff. I got this on Amazon. Also have this netting that I got on Amazon. I'm gonna cut it up in kind of overlaid on my like skirt. Oh, they're spilling on the ground. These are the pearls that I got to glue on here because they have flat backs. And I also wanna make a necklace out of this shell because I think it's the most perfect shell ever. We have a bunch of seashells that we collected over the years in these little containers. So I'm gonna kind of look through and pick some of them to glue onto the bodice of that top. And I'm also going to make hair clips out of some of them. So lots to do, like these little alligator kind of clips. 
they'll have shells and pearls on them and then I'll clip them in my hair. I'm using E6000 glue because this stuff is amazing. And then I also got this paint, which I'm hoping will be just sort of like a little pearlescent, iridescent sort of thing that's kind of sheer. And I'm just gonna paint this over top of the shells that I put on here to make them a little bit more shimmery and mermaidy. Not that that's like necessary, but it's it's fun. This is like a fun little project. <laughs> Best decision ever. I don't know if you can even tell. They just look so pretty and like frosted now. Like I, I feel like that it was just a little subtle change, but it made such a difference. Here's the progress. I've like beaded these boning areas. I have a starfish in the middle. And I also had my grandma sew it because it was way too big. So it's looking very cute. I also cut off the straps. <laughs> Working on this for a few hours now. It looks beautiful. Like, I'm honestly really happy with it. I'm gonna try and make the little hair clips now by just gluing stuff onto these. Hopefully that looks cute. I have a bunch more little shells that I painted with that sparkly iridescent paint. So I'm gonna try gluing some of those on here and some little pearls on here. downtown going to this halloween event down there afterwards we're spending the night so that we don't have to drive home at like 3 a.m when it's over so i need to pack like an overnight bag which you'd think you know it's only one night how much stuff could i need but i am a little bit high maintenance and i have quite a few things that i do need so i'm trying to collect my stuff right now i'm trying to just have like this be my bag because this bag isn't super big like this should be a sufficient overnight bag so we'll see in here i have deodorant body wash, body lotion, makeup remover, so body oil, cause I can't go to sleep without putting oil all over my body. <laughs> so I have this bag. Now I'm gonna go pack up my skincare, get my bag all put together so I can just be ready. going to the hotel early hang out downtown and go get some food beforehand and then we're gonna get ready at the hotel so i'm gonna need to like bring my makeup and stuff to get ready which is kind of annoying i honestly don't love getting ready at other places because sometimes i forget something i need and if i don't have everything that i normally have to get ready like it throws me off sometimes so i need to try to gather the makeup that i want to use for tonight 
Also for jewelry, I have this new necklace, which I think is the prettiest necklace I've ever seen. I'm Selena cast and it has pearls on it and it's just, it's perfect. I feel like this looks like exactly what a mermaid would wear, hypothetically. I also made a necklace out of this shell. This is giving me like Ursula's necklace and the Little Mermaid. Not that that's necessarily like what I was going for. I just feel like it looks like the perfect shell for a necklace. And I found it in my little container of shells that we have, so. I made a necklace out of that. I don't know if I'll wear them together because it might look weird wearing the two necklaces, but I'm gonna bring that. I am gonna just do kind of like basic normal makeup so that later on all I need to do is the eye makeup and stuff that's gonna be a little crazier, which is like blue eyeshadow and stuff. I think I wanna have kind of heavy eyeliner on. So I'm gonna do just like normal makeup right now. Makeup is done. I need to pack up my makeup now, which is kind of scary because I feel like I'm gonna forget something important, but bring my little ColourPop shadows that are all shimmery. Eyelash glue, because I want to be able to stick on little pearls onto my face and like shoulders. Bronzer and highlighters. Yeah, I grabbed like the smallest makeup bag and I'm just piling stuff in. I'm bringing like a shimmery lip gloss. I honestly just grabbed so many different pieces of makeup and brushes and stuff and threw them in here, but I kind of need to hurry up. So I'm pretty sure that's everything I'm gonna need. Perfume. I'm gonna bring this perfume because I feel like this is very beachy smelling. So. Ew, that one's yours. I thought that was mine. They look the same. Oh, I do not like coffee. All oh, this one is so yummy. Beautiful parking garage. But the water over there is pretty though. We just got to the hotel and parked and everything. It's pretty cute. We're on the ninth floor, which I like because I like being up high. So that's cool. I'll give you a quick little tour. There's like a bedroom. There's the window. The main view is the parking garage, but you can see like the Detroit River right there. So it's kind of cute. And then There's the door and this spot I think is gonna be perfect for me to like do my makeup and kind of get ready um, There's like a little couch area and then the bathroom is right there. I'm gonna kind of set up my stuff I literally brought my whole James Charles palette even though I like never use this thing It has this perfect like purpley color and this aqua color that I think would be perfect for tonight So I brought it and there's the rest of my makeup and my little outfit my top the skirt the netting and I brought little white shorts for underneath. I'm trying on the whole costume right now. I still need to like do my makeup and hair and stuff, but currently 720. I'm trying to like tie this thing around my skirt, but it just looks weird. Something isn't working. Like I want it to be down here, kind of. I don't know, I'm trying to make it work like that. I literally just have like tennis shoes to wear though because I do not want to be in uncomfortable shoes all night. <laughs>
I locked it because we keep hearing noises. Like, they keep coming in and out. And I was like, bro, oh. someone must have break in here. What happened to this one? Oh, that doesn't look yummy. We'll start munching. We just got food. And I'm surprised I'm and I'm about to have to just take it off to eat, but this looks so yummy. I'm so excited. I'm still getting ready. I feel like my makeup is not looking that good, but I'm doing my little highlighter right now, and I'm putting this ColourPop thing with this over top. Is that like too glittery? Mm -hmm. Not at all. Finally all ready and we're about to leave. I put these clips in my hair and I tried to do little fishtails But I got sick of doing the fishtail like halfway through because my hair is just too long so. I also was going to stick pearls like to my skin on my shoulders and like my face But it's too much work and I don't feel like doing that right now. So we're not gonna do that I think this top is so cute and I love <laughs> the glitter so all for today's video i really hope you enjoyed and comment the ghost emoji if you watch all the way up until the end thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye